I said get him off the screen. Denny, get him off! There he is. There's there's the good guy. This guy's great. This Fallout man? This Fallout man? He's not a racist dog. Let's get back to some Fallout. Also, you guys ever see this render? Been thinking about this a lot today. That's a good one. That's Brash from Donkey Kong Country 3. Um, let's get back to Fallout. Let's continue our journey through the, the wasteland, the capital wasteland. What's going on, fellas? Oh, my chair is getting squeaky again. I'm gonna have to screw it up tight. Um, but yeah, welcome back to Fallout. Uh, oh yeah, we died in the... What's up, Sharon? Yeah, we died. We were going this way. Um, but hello, welcome to the stream. Just Fallout and then some more Mario World tonight. So nothing nothing crazy, nothing super, super meme -y. And, uh, I'm kind of tired because I was writing my script all day. But I'm done with it. At least the, the first draft, so I'm excited about that. Um, so yeah. I'm just kind of, I'm just kind of looking to, to chill and relax tonight. Today my brother grabbed a piece of cake and ate it like an apple. Alright, we're off to a good start. Anything else going on? Where? You just said over here and then you said where? Oh right, we had to re- cause Sharon died. We had to reload earlier. Yeah, I remember that. Okay. Um... Sharon, what are you even- what was he even shooting at? I guess he got whatever it was. But, um, yeah, what's up with you guys? Anything? Do anything fun today? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, there they are. Are they good guys? They're not showing up as enemies on my map. Who are these fellas? I got a gift- a card from a family thanking me for watching their dog. Also, they tipped me $30. That's pretty legit. I was about to throw a fucking grenade at these dudes, so I'm glad I didn't. Didn't you guys say you could tip Brahmin? I guess maybe not pack Brahmin. Scavenger's dog. I want a dog. All I got is this guy. Sharon, you kind of look like this guy. You got like the same skin thing going on. And the color palette is very similar. Hey there. Wow, that's a very natural looking animation. That's good. That's a good job. I was on my way to Megaton to do some trading when I heard somebody blew the place right off the map. Jesus. Yeah, I wonder who did that. You got anything for sale? Um. Uh, you know what? Do you got any? You got any stim packs? Then you're useless to me. Uh, I need to get going. Yeah, I know. All right. Um. But yeah, in terms of direction today, we were kind of looking for some dude who was good with technology, but I'm also just, I'm kind of over that, you know? It's been a couple days, so I just, I don't really care anymore about the Android. You blew up Megaton? Maybe a little bit. Vault 106. Well, I'll be. Hold on. Do I, I don't have any quests here, do I? Hey, Sharon, you want to go in? Be careful, Sharon. There could be anything in here. If we can get in, that is. Sharon, you're you're pretty much a good sport. You kind of just go along with everything. How are you doing today, Humphrey? How do I look like I'm doing? Anybody home? Hello? Hello, vault dwellers. Um, I went to the pool in my complex today and the neighborhood kids took my float. That's very- that's fucked up. I'm telling you, dude, kids are evil. They're the worst. They just take things. This is probably for a quest and I just don't have the quest. Now, everyone in here is gonna be friendly because vaults were specifically designed to keep people safe and sane, right? There's not going to be anything bad in- Why did everything just turn purple? <laughs> what was that? Okay, but, 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 but! We didn't- he didn't even say anything, Sharon! 
purple place. Sharon, we didn't... Sharon, you shouldn't have just done that. Oh, man. Look at all this stuff. I guess this is where we're exploring today. Mm. Sharon doesn't give a shit. Sharon knew he was evil. How? Also, we don't know that guy was evil. He could have done he could have been running up to give us a hug. This thing doesn't have a whole lot of ammo left. What if it was purple? I something is definitely supposed to be happening there, but you know, Fallout 3 and computers newer than fucking Windows 98. I should probably quick save often in here. Hold on, I should probably explore the room too. Wow, this vault sucks. My vault was way better than this and my vault like fucking imploded on itself. This place is not safe. Why? Cuz I just dropped this clipboard. I'm sorry. Watch out, you might trip. This place is not safe. Hmm. Yo, is the Gary thing in this game? Because I've only ever heard about the Gary thing. I've never been to the Gary zone. Uh -huh. oh. Alright. I gotta find the Gary zone. Because I've never experienced that firsthand. This dude looks like he belongs on the, on the cover of a pizza box. Yeah, I gotta find it. If you've never heard of the Gary, the Gary Zone, you're gonna like it a lot. They talked about it in a uh, in an interview I was listening to somewhat recently on that YouTube channel that I've forgotten the name of. Uh, what's it called? Clip, clip, clip zone. No clip, maybe. Uh, yeah, they were talking about how some guy was like, "How about we just make them all do this?" And they were like, "That's the dumbest thing ever." But then they decided to do it. No clip. Which, which is what I'm doing right now, because I got stuck in the table. Okay. There's got to be something worthwhile in Vault 106. You don't let me do anything, Sharon. These guys are dying in very dramatic poses. Chat will be great in the Gary zone. I agree, 100%. Surgical tubing, darts. I'm just gonna take the darts. There's no reason not to. All right, science bobblehead. Sounds good to me. Um, that might have been the end of this place. I don't know. A, a bobblehead is a good reward. I don't know if there's anything else to to find in here. Hmm. In terms of other news, uh, not a whole lot else. I heard a rumor about a, about a supposed, like, there's like Smash Brothers leaks going around constantly. And one of them happened to mention, like, the Pikachu Funko Pop. And, and now people are jumping on board that leak. And I usually don't care. But, like, it also says that K. Rule and Dixie Kong are in Smash Brothers. So I'm kind of, just kind of been thinking about that a little bit. Thinking about that one a little bit. Just a little. Just kind of hope. Sharon? Sharon? Oh, yeah, and it's Friday the 13th. The scariest day of the year. Mm, okay, so I feel like I'm supposed to be... All right, Sharon, are you there? Are you there in, Sharon? Yeah, they're making Pokemon Funko Pops now. The world's over. It's all downhill. Um, we can use the flamer. Which which Pokemon? Which Pokemon do you guys think would look the most wonderful in in Funko Pop form? Out of all of them, any generation. Ditto. Oh, that would look terrible. Oh, that would look real bad. Wurmple. 
Uh, Wormple, Wormple might be weird enough looking to the point where it would be like they'd be okay. No, I think Ditto might be the worst. The Flamer drains your own HP. Does not. Maybe if I get close to the dude. How would Voltorb work? Voltorb and Electrode would look really bad. Mimikyu. Mimikyu would look bad because they'd put the big soulless eyes on, like, the, the body. Right? It would look really weird. Metagross. Oh, man, I can see these all in my head so clearly, like they already exist. Like that picture of Hatsune Miku Peter Griffin that I talked about that one time. They already exist in my brainscape. There's like this high-pitched humming that's going on in this place. Well, I don't have the key for that. Mm, troublemaker outfit. Is there any Pokemon that's like a, 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 like mostly eyeball? I'm just trying to think. Hmm. How would they do a Brock Funko Pop? That's a very good question. <laughs> Unknown. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, so, I don't know. I usually don't pay no mind to leaks, but when I hear about a leak and it's like, hmm, I would like this to be true, then I, I keep it in mind. We won't have to wait long to figure out if it's real or not, though, because it was supposedly, like, the 22nd we were getting a mini direct. Hmm. Remember Funko Pop Gears of War? How could I forget? How could I forget that? That was one of the highlights of my life. No, I'm not getting my hopes up. It's just a curiosity I have. Yeah, the, I don't think we can get in here yet. I don't know. Unless we can find a key somewhere, but... All this stuff is empty. Do we know what kind of game Funko Gears of War is even going to be? Oh, I took that by accident. Is it like... It's a mobile game, right? You don't got a key, do you? Hmm. Strategy. We didn't see any, like, footage of it, so I don't know. Yeah, I feel like we really missed out on everything this vault has to offer because none of the lore worked. Because Sharon broke it! It's a dating sim. All right. Yeah, I gotta get out of this place. It's making me claustrophobic. This brings me back to my days in the vault. Sharon, you know you don't know what it's like. You don't know what it's like. It was really rough down there. Have you ever dealt with, with oppression in your entire life, Sharon? I bet not. Claustrophobic like a fetus. You mean like in, in a womb? Oh, this, I don't know if I've been here yet. Mm. When it was purple, you were being drugged. But I like saw visions of the past. What is my favorite game on the PC? That is way too broad a question. Um, that's that's too difficult, because like then in most like you know is are you talking exclusive P like games you can't play anywhere else? Because like even shit like Half Life you can play elsewhere. Pajama Sam 2, you can play on the Wii, I'm pretty sure. So there's nothing. The Wii has no... The, the PS, PS PC has no exclusives.
All right, let's just leave. I'm about done with this vault. I'm about done with it. Come on, Sharon. We're leaving. What's your favorite PC in the game world? What's your favorite PC in the game world, smart guy? Are you asking me what my favorite computer within a video game is? Okay, didn't I come in through here? Where did I come in through? Yes, that's what you're asking. Uh, that's a tough one. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta figure out how to leave here. The entrance is right over here. Maybe it's down below. Can Yeah, this has gotta be it. My favorite PC in a computer game. Hmm. Sharon, you scared me again. Sharon be scaring. Yeah, the one in Pokemon's pretty reliable. Always putting shit in it. Oh. I thought I... Isn't this the exit? Yeah, why are there voices? The Pip-Boy? The Pip-Boy is weak shit. What's your favorite fucko pop in gaming? Was that a typo on purpose? Where's Sharon? Sharon, I did this all by myself. I didn't get the message about Sharon dying. Uh-oh. Well, I wanted to fix stuff. Chinese officer sword? Alright, hold on. I would like a sword. Sledged hammer. Oh, there you are, Sharon. Share dog. I need this. I need the sword. Sword is the past tense of swear. <laughs> it is. Have you ever sworn in your life? Do you want to stay alive? Come on, Sharon. All right, Sharon. The, the pattern on your shirt made you look like you were being summoned from the digital world. All right. Want to just keep heading in a direction? I feel like we got to be doing this main quest a little bit more, though. Let's be doing the main quest a little bit more. Uh, look for dad in the control room of Project Purity. Which is... All the way over there. All right. I guess we got to walk there. Hmm. Let's go from here. And we'll go down. Does Humphrey say- Oh, enough. shit! What the hell are you doing wandering around here? I just warped here. I don't know. I, I didn't mean to warp here. My mistake. I'll just be going. Smart move. We shoot anyone that tries to get into the memorial. Thanks for letting me know. Can you believe this guy? You know, we can make eye contact, Sharon. It's okay. Oh, this is not- that's, Oh, that's real nice. Hey, Sharon, you want this? What, what even is... What type of gun is this? Is it a hunting rifle? Yeah, it's a hunting rifle. Warp to Rivet City instead. Uh, that might be a better idea. But I kind of want to walk, though, you know? Like, I want to I wanna go see stuff. I don't want to just go straight there. I still hear this humming. Is it the flamer? It's the it's the flamer. It's the it's the it's the gas. You can't walk from here, Mike. Fine. Don't tell me what I can't do. That really wasn't supposed to sound like a ghoul quoting lost, but it was. It was just supposed to be lost. But then it turned into a ghoul. 
All right. I only got three bullets for this dang thing. Sub notifications dead. Have pe I haven't seen uh, any subs this whole stream. It's, it's, are people subbing and I'm not getting notified? Come on, share. Like the musician, share. Maybe that's what I'll call you. I don't see them. Yeah, I don't know. I only got two, bu two, 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 three bullets. I saw one. I didn't see one. If you've subbed and I haven't thanked you, I'm sorry. Oh, what's up, Scooter? Oh, no, Riot just subbed. Thank you for the sub. Okay. Actually, someone might have subbed earlier and I might have thanked them and then forgotten about it already. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. This game is ridiculous. Oh, nice kill. Yo, Sharon, your gun is awesome, dude. Who's crying? Serious Ugu did sub. Oh, well, thank you very much for that. I appreciate it. Oh my god. What did they do to your hair? Those monsters. Captain Fuzz Zebra, thank you very much for the sub. Uh, let's repair the minigun. Uh, leave, untie her. Oh my god. I thought I was... Dad, you saved me. They dropped this stuff. Why don't you take it? It's all I have. I'll take it. Now get out of here. They won't catch me again. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it, Humphrey. Humphrey's face when he shoots. It's so funny. <laughs> oh my god, I have a lot of grenades now. Oh shit, here we go. Uh. But yeah, tomorrow I would like to record... I don't think I could record 40 pages of dialogue in one day. But I'd like to get a good a good chunk of them done. I also want to read 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 through it and make sure it's not too too much chunky extra words in there, you know? I'm telling you, once I start reading this, I'm going to hate it and then I'm just going to say never mind. Use text to speech for the whole thing. Actually, maybe I shouldn't use text to speech or read it, but what I should do is get an unregistered hypercam and type the whole thing out again in Notepad with like a screen capture, you know? I'll just do all 40 pages in one take. With with some key gen music. Nice. Ask monkey encounter dude to read it. Man, I wonder how much he would charge for that. That's it. That's it. That takes care of that. I feel like I've become too strong since teaming up with Sharon. He's too powerful. Uh -huh. There you are. Uh -huh. There you are. Yeah, but I have no chance of hitting you from here. I almost shot you, Sharon. I should probably start taking these hunting rifles and repairing my Lincoln's repeater with them. Oh, wait, I still... 90... That's why. Okay. Then where... Let me drop these. Bingo. 
I shot the Sharon. There's lots of little jokes you can make with Sharon's name, I've realized. Alright, we should almost be there. We're at the Jefferson Memorial now. Look at all these dang tubes going into it. What is this, Super Mario? What is this, Mario World? I thought that was like a gas can. Okay. I bet Sharon loves them. Yeah, I bet he does too. Alright, I'm going into the gift shop. Sharon, you can come with me, but you can only pick out one thing. You can pick one thing. I hear gunshots in there. Uh-oh. How many words per page are on your script? 100. I, <laughs> I have no idea. That would be very small if it was only 100. Ugh! It's in size 11 font, but it's double-spaced. Got him. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Bye-bye. Times New Roman. I... Th Whatever. I wrote it in Google Docs. It was the default. I didn't change anything. All I did for formatting was I underlined new sections. Oh my god. I'm sorry if I shot you, Sharon. I don't like the way you held your gun up at me right there for a second. We're friends. For we're friends to the end, and I don't want anything to come between us. Yo, Google Docs is legit. Google Docs is the fucking best. Nothing. Rat away. Rounds. Google Docs is my favorite co-op game. Yeah, like, the, the fact that you can write shit with, with other people in Google Docs is insane. It's, a, it's crazy. We live in a crazy world. Be careful. Hmm... All right, well then let's look around a little bit more. Come on, Sharon. Hmm. Rotun ro rotunda. Hey. Where? We used to have a class Google Docs in high school and everyone would fuck around in it. Oh, that sounds so fun. Could you imagine a group of high schoolers in one Google Doc? That would be the worst place on on Earth. On inner Earth. That's what you call the internet. Earth. Inter Earth. Tell Humphrey I said happy birthday. Thank you. As the day goes on, less and less people are wishing me happy birthday. It's good to know there's still some people out there who care. Yo, ain't this where the end of the game takes place? If I recall correctly, it's been a while. Isn't this where that my that infamous ending that I hate more than anything takes place? That's my favorite. I love how bad it is. It's my favorite. I can't wait to show it to you guys. It's wonderful. But what? there must be something in there I have to touch. Be cautious. These water effects sound weird. They sound like they're being doubled. Oh, wait. Airlock control. Okay, so there's got to be something in here I have to press. Or maybe not. I don't know. Aha. 
Well, that's not it either. Where's my my thing telling me to go? Oh, that would be it right here. Oh shit, hollow tapes. Entry 5, but I skipped the first entries. Oh well. Even in Vault 101, my work on Project Purity never really stopped. This is my dad. Sharon, shh. This is my dad. Searching for, I don't know, whatever I could find. It was a Voltaic facility after all. The place was built with some of the most advanced technology this country had ever developed. Those excursions never turned up anything particularly useful. So, one night after, after a bottle of scotch, I broke into the overseer's office. It was easy enough to hack his console gain access to the restricted files. Most of it was garbage. Propaganda, spy reports, just plain rambling bullshit, really. Whoa, Dad swore. There was one thing, one name that stood out amongst all the others. Dr. Stanislaus Braun. I knew of be Braun's careful. work, of course. Shh! I told you to be quiet. Voltex sorcerer scientist, leading his peers. My dad is in this hollow tape. I gotta figure out how to get him out. First learned of Braun's involvement in Vortex social. Why is this so long? And his work on something called Gek. Gek. Nickelodeon Gek. Oh, this is so long. It was nothing short of a miracle. A terraforming module capable of producing life from complete lifelessness. But not only was this thing a reality. Yo, Gex? I love Gex. I've never played Gex. I would like to play Gex. Oh, no. I did some digging and discovered Braun's name on the reservation list for a Vault 112. Oh. No slouch, but this man, he could have easily succeeded where I failed. Uh-huh. Does his collective knowledge within the halls of Vault 112? Can I just skip ahead a little bit? Sharon, I know being a ghoul is hard, but I'm I'm dying here waiting for this hollow tape to end. You think you got it rough? Come on. All right. Well, I guess that's where I'm headed. Vault 112. I'm just a ghoul, and life is a nightmare. Okay, let's go. <laughs> let's get the fuck out of here. Mm. Ugh, look at these things. Is there, like, a, a bestiary in this game? I would like to read a bio about a centaur and read what they used to be before they became that. Has Mike played Sunshine yet? Do you mean Super, Ma Super Mario Sunshine? For the Nintendo GameCube? I've played it. I've never streamed it. I think they're part human, part doggy. Oh, that would explain it. That would explain the tentacles. Uh... Oh, shit, I gotta go all the way over there. All right, well, then let's go to Jocko's Pop and Gas Station and then walk. I know there was a closer place to the right, but I want to walk. Oh, my goodness. Hey. Those are just dogs and rats! All right! All right. Centaurs are 100% human. By definition, they are 50% horse. Sharon, I wish you would tell me more about your life. I wish I, you could, I could learn more about your backstory. You were brainwashed to, like, obey whoever has your contract. But, like, I want to know about you, Sharon. I want to know about who you were before the contract and before the, the brainwashing. Help me. <laughs> 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 All 
are you still gonna do sunshine repainted i believe that's still on the docket i don't know when that will happen and it also would be weird if i streamed sunshine repainted before i streamed sunshine not just painted normally sharon sounds like crusty the clown hey kids make sure to eat lots of crabby patties Trusty the Clown sounds like Toad. Okay. We're on the road again. Uh-oh. Rads. You okay, Sharon? Do these rads bother you? Over here. You see things so easily. Did you get, like, radioactive good vision when you became a ghoul? Mike, I think he meant the Simpsons clown. Why on earth? Okay, first of all, all right, okay, well, there's a lot to unpack about what I misunderstood there. First of all, it's Krabby the Clown from Spongebob. Second of all, that character's real identity is Mr. Krabs, so I feel like you would have just said Mr. Krabs, not Krabby the Clown. Third of all, he doesn't sound like Krabby the Clown. He sounds like Krusty the Clown from Spongebob. Which is what you were saying. Yeah, I know, I understand. All right. Okay, I'm glad that we could unpack that. All right, what's this place? Okay. I thought I heard something. Yeah, it was me shooting a gun at the at the roach. Oh my gosh. He's getting eaten by the rats! From this point on, everyone, I would like to make an announcement. If Sharon dies, it's canon. Up until now, it's he's had a free pass, and I've reloaded. If he dies from this point onwards, it's it's he's donezo. Aha. I've got your back. Who? Where where are you shooting? What are you shooting? Oh, is there something down there? <laughs> <laughs> There's something below the floor. <laughs> Sharon, you a dumbass. I'm not going to kill Sharon, but if he dies as a result of my carelessness or his own carelessness, it's just that's just it. That's just what we're going to that's it. All right, I'm going to open this car. He he's like a dog. That's running around the house after someone says walk. And he's like real excited. But he can't get through the door yet. Alright, here you go. Go get go get that roach. Oh, now that it's open, you don't want to go in? Now he's like a cat. Go. Well, that's the end of that. Mike, after you said that, you should have immediately blown him up. No, I've got more respect for Sharon than that. But Sharon had nine lives like a cat, and he's used them all up. He used a lot of them up last time. When we were fighting that, that mega mutant, and he exploded a couple times. Sharon, shh. This is gonna be real scary. Alright, we found Vault 112. No. All right, Sharon. My papa's in here. Wait, get in, get my presents, and get out. What could possibly have happened in here? This place looks nice and clean. I don't think anything went wrong here.
Welcome to Vault 112, resident. According to sensors, you have arrived 202.3 years behind schedule. Please redress in your Vault Tech issued Vault suit before proceeding. If you have misplaced your suit, I am authorized to distribute a new one. Once dressed, please proceed down the stairs to the main floor so that you may enter your assigned Tranquility Lounger. Oh, thank God. I've been waiting for that. Find the nearest Tranquility Lounger and be seated. Okay, well, I'm not... First of all, I'm not putting that on. And second of all, you should at least greet Sharon. He's here, too. Oh, shit. Look. Tranquility Lounges. Shoot it. No, I'm not gonna shoot that robot. It, it's alive and has feelings. It has a brain. What do you think? What do you think I am? Some sort of monster? Oh, he's alive in there. Look at that. Look at they're alive in there. Are you are you awake? Sharon, you scared me again. Hold on. I gotta take a look. Oh yeah, this is very relaxing. He doesn't... I don't think he's even an NPC. I think he's just an object. Yeah, he just seems to... He's. I think they're just objects. That one's empty. Oh shit, look at that scary shit. Yeah, they, they don't count as, as living beings. All right, well then, uh, one of these is empty. So maybe this one's for me. Hmm. Well then, let's put Sharon in this one. That would be great. Hey Sharon, you wanna take a nap? Hmm. This one is also empty. Only residents wearing the Vault 112 suits may use this lounge. That's very garbage, but alright. How does it even know? He's just mad because he had to watch Humphrey change right in front of him. All right, I'm going in. I'm going in. Birthday booster seat. Oh, I kind of remember. Th what the fuck? Did you see that? There was a ghost on the screen! I remember this. I remember this! I remember this. Oh, I leveled up in here. <laughs> uh... Explosives. No, come on, Michael. Let's do let's do some small guns, maybe. Small guns up to twenty-five. I feel like from now on we should just every time we level up, just pump it all into one thing. Like science, small guns, baby guns. Ah, energy guns are fun too though. We are now much more skilled with, with energy guns. And we will do... Uh, what was the one I... Uh, with each rank of this perk, you gain an additional 15 points to the big gun skill. hey oh, that's pretty good. That might be worth doing. 
Gun Nut. With each rank of the Gun Nut perk. Actually, this one's pretty good. Small Guns and Repair. Yeah, let's do that. Look at that. Look at that chin. Oh boy! It's my ninth birthday today! I sure do love being nine Look years old! Sport. Beautiful day, isn't it? Say, you should go talk to Betty. She's waiting for you over on the playground. Have fun, sport! Oh boy! Oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> he has no butt. <laughs> Astute observation. Hiya, kiddo. What's the good word? Nice day, is it? Yep, you've got that right. Heck of a day to get some work done outdoors. This fucking music. Hi there. Oh, sh That's not how you whistle. That's not how whistling works. Also, she was the ghost I saw. She was the ghost on the screen. Oh, someone new to play with. What good luck I have lately. Oh, that's such a good child just voice. Just trying to get bored. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. What a great child voice. <laughs> Looking for my father. Have you seen him? Gee, I don't know. What's he like? He's an older guy. Around 40, 50, 50 or so. And he's new here too, isn't he? Oh boy, he's your daddy, huh? I had no idea. That makes this even more fun. Let's play. A game? Okay, I guess. I knew you would. It's a really simple game. All you have to do is make Timmy Newsbum cry. Oh, I, I'm great at that. That's it? I can do that. You can? I guess we'll see. Huh. Good luck. So are you just gonna? So are you just gonna stand there? He's looking like Caillou. This doesn't even work like it does in Half Life. You can't access weapons. There's no we. Oh, you can. You gotta watch Humphrey. Since when you got a watch? Look, you can even see a vault boy on it. Alright. Check your pit boy. Oh! Are you, are you the child I'm supposed to make cry? I'm sorry. Wait, this would be really funny if he was like a grown man selling lemonade. Hi there. <laughs> Jimmy. Want to play? Hey, I heard your parents are getting a divorce because of you. Have you seen my dad? Your dad? Nope, I haven't. Did he get lost? Uh. None of this is real. It's some crazy experiment. What? You're weird. Bye -bye. How can I make... Can I just take his stuff? Where did you go, Timmy? Timmy, where... Oh, hey. I need to make you cry. Hi. Wanna play? No. See I can make him even older. Hi. Wanna play? Okay. So oh, you can still use fats. You can still use fats. It actually might be funnier if Humphrey is a kid. It might be funnier if I'd use Vats as a child. Uh... 
I'm not sure if I can use fat. Yeah, you can use fats as a kid. I made him cry. <laughs> no, no. Good day. Yo, there's a dog here? His name is Doc. Good doggy with an IE. You, you don't belong here. You're not supposed to be here. It's not real, none of it. It needs to end. The suffering must end. Uh. Get away from me, you crazy old bat. You're the only one who can end it. You must end it, don't you see? You are the only one who can disable the failsafe. I'm serious. Get the hell away from me. You need to know the truth. Otherwise, he'll suck you in just like all the others. Beware. Yeah, whatever, you crazy old coot. What's the big idea? I should probably revive her. I made a t-shirt. Does it count as art? I mean, if it's stream related, sure. I shouldn't kill people. I don't know if I need them alive. All right, let me go uh, talk to this girl and tell her that I made him cry. As amusing as it is, <laughs> you cannot simply wander around killing the residents of Tranquility Lane. <laughs> I shall have to reset portions of the system to correct this. I can return the people of Tranquility Lane to life, but anything else you have meddled with will stay as it was. I don't remember this Do at all. Keep that in mind. I, I have to... You sure showed him, didn't you? What was that about? I suppose it wasn't the most cerebral way to deal with the situation, but it was definitely effective. Consider the game won. And with that, you win a prize. Your prize is one question which I will answer to the best of my ability. With my father. Ah, yes. A predictable question, I suppose. Your father is here, in Tranquility Lane. He is quite safe for now, though he can no longer hound me with his incessant questioning. Perhaps you will see more of him in time. I want to see him now. Hmm. No. No. I don't think so. We haven't yet plumbed the depths of your ability to amuse me. I think you'll do a few more things for me first. What do you want me to do? Pay a visit to the Rockwells. They're very happily married, and I'd like you to change. Them. I can do that. That's it. No problem. I can do that. Rockwells, you got it. Take a hype, what? Good day. Hiya, kiddo. What's the good word? Mmm. Can you tell me anything about the Rockwell's marriage? Now, what's a kid like you want to know about that? Kind of grown up stuff to be worried about, don't you think? Well, don't you worry your head about it. They worked out their problems a while ago. Haven't heard them fight in a long time. Yeah, we'll see about that. 
Good day. Hello. <laughs> what is he incorporeal? <laughs> what was that shit? Oh, here we go. Hello. You won't get away with that. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? Hey there, sport. How's it going? Uh, Betty wants to break up your marriage. Now that's not funny. Not one bit. Anything you want to tell me about your marriage? Now see here. That's not anything for you to be asking about. Our marriage is our business and it's private. Why can't people just understand that and just leave us alone? Hmm. How can I break up their marriage without killing one of them? Just gotta, they have to have some secrets in their basement. Oh, cool. This is a fucking creepy basement. What the hell? You have nothing of interest to place on the de- Oh, okay, so I clearly have to place evidence or something. Hello. Well, hi there. Well, hi there. Um... Betty wants to break up your marriage. What? Now that's a ridiculous thing to say. You kids need to find some different games to play. No. T tell me about your marriage. Our marriage? Oh, goodness. What kind of a question is that? Mabel didn't put you up to this, did she? What a silly thing to ask about. Hmm. Yeah, don't mind me. Just the neighbor's kid running in here with a rolling pin. You can still drink from the toilets in this world. What does that look like in third person? Okay. Yeah, they're clean. I'm not getting any rads. I can sleep in their bed. Uh... Diary. I just know if I can do it anymore. When Roger's not in the stupid basement, he's outside. Sweet talking that hussy Martha Simpson. All right. I'm going to put this on his workbench. Um. What? Wish I had beat her to death with that rolling pin. Martha. Martha was going Hi, to be killed. Hi, Roger. Are you planning on spending the evening down in the basement again? Later. What? Hmm. Let's go find Martha Simpson. I can't take the de the diary. So I'll just leave it here for now. Let's go look for Martha Simpson. Really necessary. No, I'm sorry. Are you Martha Simpson? Good you're, day. you're Mabel. I think you have to put the rolling pin on the table, not the diary. Ha! I don't have to go see Ma uh, uh, Margie, Martha. Good day. That's her. That's got to be her. Yeah, you. Well, hi there. Um. Can you tell me anything about the Rockwell marriage? Why are you asking me? I don't know anything. And why should I care about their marriage anyway? Okay, if you say so. People around here should mind their own business. Hmm. Have a great... All right, well, let's go put the rolling pin there. 
What happened, Garden Gnome? Come on. Get it together. Get it together. You have to kill her with it first? You have to kill her with it? Oh, the game crashed. Cool. I guess I have to kill her with it first. Good, good. Yes. That was for no reason, too. Just like walking up the stairs. I guess we got a framer. Hello. You'd think they would suspect me seeing me run around with this thing. Good day. No one will know. Oh my god. One fucking hit! That wasn't even... Like, she just fucking went down in one smack! The simulation prevents from tampering with the body. Oh, it does? You're easily amused, eh? All right. Let me just go ahead and do this real quick. Hello. Good day. Hello. You can see me with this bloody uh, rolling pin. Hello. Hello, I'm just going to put this right here. Are you sure? Talk to Roger first. Well, hi there. Bad news, Roger. Your wife is a psychopath. What? What are you talking about? Martha Simpson is dead, and Janet killed her. Look, here's the rolling pin. But Janet would never... I mean, I know she was upset, but I thought she was over it. How could she do this? Oh, shit. Here it comes. My God. Janet, what have you done? What on earth are you talking about, Roger? How could you? How could you do that to her? Why would you just believe this kid? Roger, stop it. You're scaring me. You should be in a sanitarium or a prison. You're out of your damn mind. You just stay away from me, you hear me? Nice family you got here. This is like, this reminds me of Toontown. Except in black and white. Who's that running? Alright, well, it doesn't matter. I completed the, the task you made me do. Poor Janet and Roger. Quite a clever interpretation of the rules. I'll have to reset the system to restore Martha. But it's well worth the effort. You have taken a far greater interest in these little games than your father did. <laughs> he found the whole thing beneath him. I gotta admit it, kind of fun. What can I do next? I am pleased to see I'm not the only one being entertained. You are far more agreeable than your father. If you wish for more, then so be it. But let's raise the stakes a bit this time. I'd like you to kill Mabel Henderson. Can do. She'll never see it coming. No problem. Hello. This is hopeless. Help! Ah! Now, that was Mabel, wasn't it? Oh, do I need to take something? To make it look like an accident. She's at the bottom of the stairs. It's perfect. She fell down some stairs. You 
could have messed with the stuff in her house to make it explode or something. Well, now I don't think I did it right. How did this blood get here? Oh, right. She, I chased her. Right. She fell up the stairs. Well, my quest marker is still telling me to go in there, so I don't know if this will work, but... I did what you asked. I believe we've discussed this already. I appreciate the fervor with which you approach things, but indiscriminate, I shall... Okay, all right. I'm sorry, I did it wrong. I did it wrong. She's back. Good day to you. Um... How am I supposed to... How, how am I supposed to do this? There must be, like, something I can sabotage. Like this. Fiddle with the pilot light. Beautiful day to use a stove, huh? Aren't you hungry? Couldn't you go for a nice, heated meal? Mabel. Wouldn't you like to use the stove? Good day. Oh good, I'm scrolling through chat. One sec. Alright. Can you make me a grilled cheese? Good day to you. I heard you make really tasty pies. Can you make one for me? Well, sh let me just go light the Boy, that worked really well. Good day to you, young master. Hello. Appliances certainly can't, <laughs> can't they? You are most resourceful, and you certainly do get results. You have exceeded my expectations. And now... We come to the last tasks that I have for you. Succeed, and you shall be... Okay. Uh... I can't wait. What do you want me to do? Your enthusiasm is inspiring. It's a shame you didn't arrive earlier. Now, you will become the pint-sized slasher and kill everyone in Tranquility Lane. Behind the abandoned house, there is a doghouse. Inside... All right. Sounds like fun. Do I gotta kill you too? You can't do that here. And now you have to pay. What? <laughs> you can't do that here. The way she slowly turned to me when I punched her. <laughs> you can't do that here, and now you have to pay. Hold on. She looks so offended. Okay, let's go get the knife. There's a way to cause the Chinese communists to evade and kill everyone. What? What about the, the mask? Oh. That's a terrible mask. I don't like it at all. Turn on god mode and do that again. That's not a bad idea. Oh, now everyone's afraid of me. Hold on. You can't do that here. And now you have to pay. I think I soft locked it. <laughs> yeah, it's soft locked. All right, well, let's load. Okay, so we just gotta kill everyone. That's fine. I can do that. No problem. I'm not killing the dog because I think that's my dad. But I'm gonna kill everyone else. Oh no! Please, leave me. The point. No. <laughs> oh, 
Holy shit. Turn off. Go oh, does it still on? Yeah. Does it still on? Oh, God. Help. Help. They're too fast. Oh, oh my God. It's the pint size slasher. You might be able to kill everyone, then use the fail safe. Listen, I don't know what you're talking about. Wait, you didn't die in one hit! Uh oh! <laughs> oh God! Help! Help! Whatever. I've got better. Yes, it was nothing. What are you talking about? Well, she's just trying to make me leave by like. Trying to convince me I don't exist. Ooh. Ooh! Jesus Christ. The pine size slasher. You can get her. How did you you teleported? <sighs> Listen, karma doesn't exist in this world. This is a this is a simulation. Oh, do I gotta kill with little Timmy? No, no, ah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Little Timmy isn't so little anymore. He's an old man. This is sort of fucked up. Milky, thank you very much for the sub. Who the hell was that? Alrighty. Should be one more to do. I wanted to try to jump on his back, but I don't think you can do that. Why don't they fight back? I have no idea what... This is so weird. Alright, I did it. Most enjoyable. Most enjoyable indeed. <laughs> I haven't felt this exhilarated in years. I did what you wanted. Now let me out. Or actually, that was fun. I had the distinct impression you enjoyed yourself. We are alike. You and I. Now, you asked for the means to leave Tranquility Lane, and so I grant it to you. The door is open. You are a f All right, well, I'm going to just go ahead and leave. See you later. What's up, young? Oh, shit, look at his hair. He was in there too long. Sharon, you don't know what it... You don't know what I saw in there. It was horrible. Son, you've saved me. I was afraid I'd be trapped in there forever. It's so good to see you, but but what are you doing here? Oh hey Sharon, this is my this is my dad. Dad, we're we're actually we're on a quest right now. Can you stop bothering me? I came here to find you. Well, I'm glad you did. This certainly wasn't how I expected things to turn out. I wasn't ready for brawn, or I might have fared better. Well, you didn't like being a dog? Well, I suppose it had its moments. But in the end, I much prefer having opposable thumbs. And now that I'm back, I can get back to work. I need to tell Madison what I've learned. What did you learn? I was right about brawn. The technology he developed is unstable and even dangerous. But it can be adapted for Project Purity. I need to return to Rivet City and talk with- Okay, Qui-Gon, go ahead. Yes. All right, let's head to Rivet City. Let's hurry. Um... Did Mom- How did Mom really die? 
I understand that you have reason to question a good many things I've told you over the years. But your mother... I've never lied to you about what happened. She died giving birth to you. Oh, right. I saw it's that. Not... I remember that. Okay. Um, let's go. Oh, I thought we were traveling together. I'm going to follow him. Hello, sir. We're going on a journey, the three of us. Sharon! Sharon! Sharon, no, 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 come on! Sharon, we gotta go on the journey with him. We're gonna lose him! Sharon, what are you doing? You return. Yes! Let's get going! Come on! No, we're gonna we're gonna lose him! We just reunited with him and now we're gonna lose him again! I'm not playing with mods, no. Uh I gotta put back on my uh recon armor and my uh Lincoln hat and my glasses. Go, go, come on. Sharon doesn't like Humphrey's dad. Do you think it's because Sharon has sort of taken on a, a fatherly role for Humphrey and he's jealous? We're just going to follow him. We're going to follow him all the way there. Come on, Sharon. Come on. You'd think this dude would be, like, more excited about seeing his son. He's just like, no, I gotta go. I'm going to Rivet City. Ribbit City. The city of frogs. Just three men. On a cross-country journey together. Where are they going? Nobody knows. This is this is exciting. Look at this. Look at this. That's the way you want to oh shit, we're just gonna yeah, yeah. No, see, so is he just gonna run all the way to Rivet City? Because that's far. <laughs> he gonna I do kinda wanna see how he like manages to do this. This is such a long trip. And knowing Bethesda's pathfinding, like, I feel like he's just going to get lost or killed. That's, like, the whole map he's just going to run across. Make him bigger so he moves quicker. That's a great, that's a good fucking idea. Though if I make him too big, I think it crashes, it crashes the game. Oh, is he linked to my movement? Yeah, he's not going to move much faster than I am. Yeah, he's like leading me. Even bigger. Make yourself big too. Alright, then. Uh, yeah, I'll tell him I'll meet him there then. Let's set skill to point five so I can catch up with him. Oh, wait. I gotta click on him first. Wait, I gotta talk to you. I gotta talk to you. I gotta talk to you. What do you need? All right, I'll meet you there. Um, I'm sorry to hear that. All right. So now he's gonna go on his own, and I'll just make him huge so he'll get there real fast. Don't crash the game. Don't crash the game. There he goes. <laughs> Holy shit. What is he even shooting at? Oh, there's a little robot. Oh my god! <laughs> Sharon, he's got this. What the? Is that him? <laughs> oh my god. He's so big he gets in fights with everything. 
I don't even know if he can hit shit. There he goes. Look at that stride. Look at him go. God bless. God fucking bless. Oh, disappeared from... S <laughs> What's happening here? I thought we lost him. This looks like something out of your movie maker streams. It kind of does. Oh my god. background it was beautiful <laughs> oh my god he's massive I'm gonna lose him oh you could just see his head over there Sharon this is crazy like I know that we should just teleport there but I'm kind of enjoying like trying to like find him it's like fucking where's waldo except waldo's giant and he's your dad there he is there he goes but he keeps teleporting back into my field of view I love the way he crouches down to shoot things. Yo, is that a death claw? What is that? What is that? No, that's not a death claw. I don't think. Oh, are all my hotkeys unbound because of the fucking... Oh, this game sucks. Why would they do that? Why would they do that? Oh, fuck. Ripper, uh, I don't know, laser rifle, I'm just gonna fucking re-equip stuff wherever I feel like it, uh, Chinese assault rifle is three, uh, four, it was Lincoln's repeater, uh, five, I can make the minigun, six, I'll make the flamer, seven, I'll make the, uh, combat shotgun, or the terrible shotgun, and then eight, I'll make the... Uh, grenades. Okay. <gasps> Whoa! Oh. Holy shit. Wow, my dad doesn't give a fuck. That thing almost killed me. What is that floating behind him? Is that his gun? Oh no. Sharon, I actually need your help for this. Sharon, I need your help. These things are very fucking strong. Sharon! How? Charles. Charles, thank you for the sub. I said it was that- I said that was it. Oh wait, but it's not canon because I died before I got the chance to save. No, 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 that's cheating. He's dead. I said he would die. Where is Sharon though? Hold on. I'm just curious how he died. Oh, he's fighting something. What are you fighting? What killed you? Was it this?
If you both die, it's not canon then. I don't know. Alright. Alright, okay. Then we'll just continue from here. If he dies and I live, then it's canon. What is the, the origin of the name of these things? I always thought this was weird. He's like a mutant bear, but he's called a Yao Guai. Why is that? Yao Y is he called that? There he goes. That's my dad. Is it Chinese for bear? Someone in chat said. Chinese prisoners named them that. Okay. Well, now I know. It means monster in Chinese. Who are you fighting now? Another one? No, that's just a scorpion. You got this. What do you look? What are you doing? What is he doing? It's just going to kill you. Why are you just examining it? Sharon, protect my father. That thing just bit his dick! That was timed really funny where I was like, Sharon, I need help, and then it immediately popped up on the screen, Sharon is dead. That was very good. I mean, I said we weren't gonna walk to Rivet City, but this is so entertaining, just watching Giant Dad try to do things. He's, he's out of our sights now, but we'll, we'll see him again. As soon as we get over this hill, we'll see him. We'll see his head. I wish it was daytime, but if I wait till daytime, he'll disappear. He's got to be down here somewhere. He gets sidetracked by everything. I mean, we can see him on the map. I have a quest marker on him, I think. I could make myself bigger... I guess, to catch up with him. Or I could change player speed. But, like, I kind of enjoy going about this and just, like, kind of running into him every now and then. Where are... Where are he? Where are he? He, like, he could be any of the buildings. Yeah, he got... He, he went real far. And then Sharon will be too small and he won't be able to keep up with me. Yeah, I think he I think he's gone. I think he just booked it. Yeah, I think he's gone, guys. Oh shit. Well, we'll see him again someday. I don't know, Sharon, maybe at Rivet City where he said he was going to go. What's going to blow? The truck? What's gonna blow? You scared- Sharon, you scared me! Oh. He's way too big for that boat. Yeah, we're gonna run into some problems there, I feel. How long until Super Mario World? Uh, how long have I been streaming this? Sharon. You warned me. He said it's going to blow. It took a while, but... Oh, I've only been streaming this for an hour and a half, so just, like, probably another half hour. Maybe we should fast travel over there. I'm worried about him navigating that, that boat. He's way too big for those hallways. And the little Zimmer man is going to be very scared of him. Over here. Uh-oh. Running low on health, Sharon. 
Ooh, that was close. All right, aid. Let's fix our body up a little bit. Uh, status. Okay. Now let's use stim packs normally. Alright, you want to fast travel, Sharon? Let's do it. One final look for Dad. I'm not seeing him. He's gone. I think the game might break if you let him get to Rivet City because he's supposed to be in the room with... Yeah, that's what I'm afraid of! <laughs> we let him... Wait. What is this? This is... Is this where Dad is over here? Why do I have... To... Hold on. Which, what is this mark? That's the... Why is he all the way down there? I guess because he's, he's, he can't run straight there. We're actually getting kind of close to him. He has to go through the subway station. Guys, I think we've, we've created a problem. I think he's too big and it's going to cause issues. We have to find him and shrink him before it's too late. He could destroy us all. We have to stop him. Jaren, we gotta find Dad. Quick. Uh, he's gotta be over here. Up your speed in the console. No, because that's cheating. We have to solve this problem without cheating. I used cheating to create it. Two wrongs don't make a right. Sharon, where is he? We gotta stop. We gotta stop him. <laughs> over here. He couldn't have fit through this alleyway. We'll find him. Don't worry. I don't see him. This is kind of fun. Oh, wait! Something moving. Nope, that's not him. It's too small. Where is he? Is he already inside? What was that explosion? We might be too late. There he is! Oh, he got stuck! He's stuck. Oh! No, he's getting away! Stop, Dad, stop! Oh, we found you. <laughs> Hello, son. Good to see you again, son. Okay. We found you. Uh. Okay, let's shrink him. Let's shrink him down. There he goes. Fine. Get back to normal. Except now I, th I think he just hit a dead end here. This, is, this might just be typical Bethesda pathfinding here. I don't think he knows how to get there. Make him smaller as a punishment. Sharon, can you believe this? He doesn't... Look at him. He's doing the stanky leg. Blow up the bus. That might be what we gotta do. That's dangerous. Get out of the way, Sharon. Bitch, me too! <laughs> why was that such a big explosion? <laughs> Wait, now why are you... Watch for your guy. Okay, let's try that again. Still? How big is that? 
Holy shit! What the fuck? Yeah, I guess there's a lot of cars there. It's like a chain reaction. Alright, get farther away, Sharon. Dad is unconscious. <laughs> Where did he end up? Oh, there he is! <laughs> there he is! He's walking it off. He's fine. He's fine. That was fucking hilarious. <gasps> she says I was missile launcher right in my face. Humphrey, this is not the time to miss! Jesus, that was close. I haven't even used the missile launcher yet, have I? Uh, can I repair mine? Yeah, I should probably use that. Oh, fuck, there's a lot of dudes over there. Let's use the missile launcher, why not? I haven't used it, I got five missiles. Sharon? No, 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 Sharon, you gotta get away from them. Let's try to hit some dude over here. Oh, that's a turret. That's not fun. Okay, here we go. No. I'm gonna shoot it at her. Okay. Well, that takes care of that. Ah, uh, bottle cap. You might say that was a waste of missiles, but it's okay. I learned. Okay, well now that we're not worried about dad collapsing the universe, let's let's just warp to Rivet City. Wait, where's dad? He's still back there? He doesn't warp to Rivet City? Hey, Carlos. I think I just tried to pickpocket Carlos and he didn't mind. Now we wait. Let me just wait an hour. Sharon, what? Can you please not do that? Where is he now? <laughs> what is he doing? Let's wait another hour. Oh, he's making it. He's making it. He's going in real time. Yeah, he's getting closer. He's here. He made it. Took him an hour to swim across the irradiated river. Wait till he meets Small Zimmer. He's gonna love that guy. Hello. And child security guard. He's gonna love that guy and child doctor. Hello. Hello. All right. Told you it would work, What's going on here? Jane, you're back. CJ, who's this? Oh, you're that- you're the kid from the simulation! If we can find one, we can adapt Where's little Zimmer? There he is. There he is. Did you have a gun before? Are you armed? Madison, I'm telling you, this is real. I talked to Braun himself. He confirmed it. Don't you see? This is what we've been waiting for. Yeah, I wonder if you make the dad young. He looks like Humphrey as a child. 
No, he looks a little different. Look at that chin, though. Look at the chin. How could it not be worth improving the lives of everyone in the wasteland? What could be a more worthy endeavor? You haven't lost any of your passion. Dude, looking like Milo from Project Natal. Okay, where's Dad? Uh, there you go. It's important to you too. Let's finish it together. We don't have a gag. Why did you just pick up that carrot? Did you just eat that? I heard a crunch. Janice, that was a floor carrot. I love how Sharon's just here. <laughs> he doesn't know what the fuck is going on. Even if one of those computers had a database, we couldn't access it. That's why we're going to head over there right now and get things. Deku, thank you very much for the sub. You know, if it were anyone else asking me to do this, I'd have them run right out of Rivet City. You know I wouldn't be here if I didn't think this would really work. It's time. Okay. Damn you, James. When this is all over, Damn you, James. Great take. I'll get the team together. Thank you, Madison. It's good to be working with you again. Hello, son. Okay. We need to get back to Project Purity. The computer there is our best chance. All right. Uh. All right. Let's get going. That, it'll be good to work side by side with you, son. Sharon's like. Hey there. Yeah. Just the three of us. Are you just gonna walk the whole way? Are we going on a mi- I don't wanna walk the whole way. Cannot fast travel to this location. Let's just- <sighs> Yeah, cause we had to leave first. Can't wait to spend some quality time with you two. What's this guy's name? She just said it. Is it James? like, hey, James, I can tell you all of Humphrey's favorite things. You know, because I've been there for him. You haven't been. Oh, there's another James. What do you want? Hey, James. You don't need to be scared of who? What? I ain't scared. And I ain't your son. Any other stupid questions, asshole? That was not read correctly. Any other stupid questions, asshole? That was supposed to be read like a question. Uh, that's not the right way. Uh, I fucking hate Rivet City. Hello, son. Hello, son. Hello, son. All right, let's go to the Jefferson Memorial. You should scale Sharon to 1.25. Do you think he should... Yeah, I mean, we've had him for a while. He's got to grow a little bit. That's a little bit, but all right. He's just... It's just a little bit bigger. Just a little bit. All right, let's go. What the fuck is happening with my quest marker? What the... Does it right here? Well, I'm going to go up here and take a look around. Hmm. Also, where's where's father? Where's father? Oh, I guess I go in the gift shop again. Maybe my objective's telling me to go over here. Yeah, all right. Let's see what's in here. Just wait till he gets here. No, I'm going in without him. We already killed all the super mutants in here. You in here, dad? Is 
Isn't this where you wanted to get to? I guess we'll just have to time wait. You cannot wait in this location. Can I wait in this location? There we go. That's a good wait. That's a good wait. That's a good solid wait. Cuddles, I might do the DLC. I mean, I'm still working through the main quest and stuff. Also, Cello, thank you very much for the bits. Uh... And the football giveaway. Hey, hey, Dad, where are you? Sharon, did you see him? Sharon, I'm still getting used to your new size. You're only a li- Oh, hello. You're not, Dad. I'm still getting used to Sharon's- Like, he's just a little bit bigger, but it makes a difference. I wish I could play this game in VR and stand next to Sharon and see how big he was in real life. Where the fuck? Join the scientists at Project Purity. Ain't that where I was? He'd probably scare me in, in VR. Everything scares me in VR. Oh, okay, they're all outside. That was a good, that was a good toss. Alright, let's load. I'm not, I'm, that's not canon. Ralph, thank you very much for the sub. Okay. Is everything alright? Yeah, we're fine. We can't accomplish anything until we can get inside. But none of us I already cleared it out. Capable fighters. I already cleared I it out. I ask you to put yourself in harm's way, but you seem to have learned to handle yourself. I need you to go in and make sure it's safe for Dr. Lee and her crew. Sure thing. Uh, uh, can I just make, can I just say it's already safe? Thank you. It is safe. It's literally safe. Are you alright? Is it? I'm working on it. I guess I can't till it's t totally safe. Listen, there's like maybe one super mutant in here. Maybe one. Sharon may be giant, but he's not a threat. Uh-oh. I don't think we've explored Sharon. Are you going to be too big to fit in here? No, he's fine. Haven't explored this little area. Let me go ahead and uh, hit this. You cannot use this now. All right. Okay, alright, this place is useless to me then. Scally Cat, thank you very much for the sub. Yeah, that's fine. Let's find all these super mutants. There can't be too many. There can't be. I cleared this place out. Hmm... It's kind of weird that the game makes you come here and then leave and then come back. Maybe if I make noise, I can draw them out like rats. Hello? Sub basement. I don't think I've explored the sub basement. Yeah, we're good. This is where they are. This is where those those monsters are. Now try it away, you fool. 
Oh, hello. Sharon, this is dangerous. Don't you die. You're on your last life. Oh, I protected you, Sharon. <gasps> Whoa! The sub-basement is like a wine cellar, but for sandwiches. That's one of the best comments I've ever seen. <laughs> nice! Thank you for the, yeah, Cello, if you wanna- if you wanna spam 150 bits to give people emotes, you can, I'm just not gonna, like, thank you over and over, but no, I, I do very much appreciate it. So yeah, if you would like to, feel free and thank you. Um... Okay. Let's keep looking. Did, didn't someone say that these football emotes aren't even, uh, aren't permanent? Aren't they, like, just temporary? You cannot sleep while enemy- He's my friend! Sharon and me are friends! Hey. Oh. Hey! Who- Remember those TF2 hats that you could unlock at Christmas time? I mean, not Christmas time. Just Halloween time, and you can only wear them around Halloween and when the moon was full? That was fucking weird. I always hated that. I guess we gotta listen to these. Uh. Because a lot of those were cool, and it's like, if you, like... The Christmas ones you could wear year-round, and they were... Totally seasonal. Waters of life could be a reality. And that's why this is a momentous occasion. Jeez, Cello, thank you. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> How many do you have? Thank you. This is just the beginning. Oh, he's activating football giveaways. Every emotes for everyone. <laughs> I told him it was okay. It's all right. It's that I mean that helps me out, so thank you. This is day two of my attempt to resurrect this project. I got one of the portable. Yeah, the difference is they gave out the Halloween ones for free. It's just enough to power the emergency lighting and a couple of other systems. Also, That's now, true. I, need help powering up I still never had more fun with TF2 than I did during the second Halloween event with the uh Rat. with the with the headless horseman. And the, the mansion map. That was my favorite shit. I loved that. It was so fun. It went about as well as I expected. That is to say, she thinks I'm completely mad. Okay. How can I blame her? She's got her own life, her own team, is making real, tangible stuff. Yeah, I still have, like, all the original items from that, too. I just used to have so much fun on that map, like, they'd, they'd activate the giveaway, and then everyone would kind of fucking stop fighting and just look for the present. I was good at finding that present. I was good at it. I remember just sitting in my room in the autumn at night, like, after school. Man. It was, like, such a good time, man. And, like, you know, you just fucking... I was just playing as the scout, and I was running around that map looking for presents. And the people on the map, uh, on, like, the servers, were usually pretty nice, too. Like, some servers you'd go on, people were, like, taking turns finding the presents and everything. That was fun. This is, like, the first time I've been underwater in this whole game. Yeah, I mean, I haven't... I, I actually played TF2 with giraffes, like, a couple months ago. And it was pretty much exactly how I remembered it. But I don't really... I still really don't have any desire to go back to it. I associate TF2 with, like, high school. And it's just, like, I don't know, not playing with my friends from high school. And it just isn't the same anymore. Just because I've grown up. 
Oh my god. TF2 was a very high school game for me. And it just doesn't feel the same playing it now. Which is sad, but like, you know. I had good memories with it. Because, like, I booted it back up and, like, we were playing it and having some fun, but it's like, I don't know. Just didn't have that same, didn't have that same feeling to it. Alright, well, we just have to clear this place out. I don't see any more red dot. Uh-oh. No, that's just Sharon. I remember all, like, the, remember when it came out on Mac and everyone had to get the earbuds? I had earbuds because my family had a Mac. Like, a, like the computer that everyone in my house shared was a Mac. And then, like, I had a PC. It was my first computer, my first, my own computer. But I, like, used, I, like, logged in on the Mac and I got the earbuds. They were, like, expensive as shit, too. People were, they were worth, worth like, 50 bucks in real money. Now they're worth, like, two bucks. That's crazy. That's crazy. I had, like, a lot of those rare things. I had Bill's hat, too. No, I never had any unusual hats, either. I know people who did. Wait, there were earbuds, like, for Mac computers? Yeah! When you signed in on a Mac, you got, like... Like Macintosh earbuds, iPod earbuds, and they were like super valuable for some reason. That's the big idea. All right, that's everything. Are you all right? Everything in there is dead. I'm proud of you. Uh. All right. How did they lose value? Yeah, that, I mean, I don't know either. Can people still get them? If there's a finite number of them, how are they losing that? I don't know how that fucking economy works. The whole TF2 economy was crazy. Keys are 35 refined. What? Weren't they, like, two back in the day? I have no idea. Did you need something? That's crazy. It's, it's kind of interesting, honestly, how they managed to, like, make a fucking economy in a video game, you know? Alright, so everyone's just kind of wandering around here. I don't like the way she says that to me. Did you need something? Hey. Neopets did it first. Is everything alright? <laughs> hey. Here we are, where it all began. Okay. You remember your mother's I His present? fucking lip clips Revelation through. <laughs> I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and Omega. the end. Omega. Omega. Him that is a thirst Sounds like he's the of the water starting of the to say, oh my god, Omega. Don't you see? This is what it all means. The water, the purifier. This is the water of life. Oh. The mother's dream. Oh. No point in wasting time. Let's get to work. There's much his to be done. Fucking clips through his mouth. Uh What do we need to do right now? The project was abandoned shortly after you were born. Things have deteriorated here since then. I need you to get to the flood control. Oh, I already saw those. The automatic doors sealed when the flooding occurred. I I know where that is. Someone asked why his eyes are all buggy. Because they uh the game tries to make him look like your player character, and I'm playing as this guy. So, I think the game tried really hard to make him look both like a normal person and like my character, and it didn't work out too well. Yeah, I didn't know that the game did that too, and then I was like, guys, why does he look so fucked up? And everyone was like, oh, they're just, he's trying to look like, they try to make him look like Humphrey. And I'm like, okay. Alright. Alright, we gotta find those access tunnels. Which are over here. Oh, that, that 
Can I can I get to that button? All right. Got to hurry back. I'm going to switch games real soon, probably when I'm done with this quest. This quest is pretty it's like I think I'm pretty much done with it. This is really fun. Sharon's having a good time. Oh, thank you for the raid, Desert. Again, you raided me right before I was about to switch games. Um, thank you. Did, have you noticed that Sharon is a little bit bigger this time? Just a little. Just a tiny bit. We've decided to make Sharon a tiny bit bigger. Earlier, our the dad was, uh, was four times the size he usually is, and he was running rampant throughout the wasteland, causing mischief. And we had to hunt him down, and it was very fun. It was a good fucking time. See, let's see what would have happened had... Had Catastrophe struck, and had Dad managed to reach this place before we stopped him, this is what we would have been dealing with. This is gonna crash the game. No, we're good. <laughs> is everything alright? <laughs> I don't know, you tell me! I think we need to talk. Oh, I don't like that! <laughs> I've been hearing things. No! Like no, I don't like this. Go back to normal. <laughs> now we're too close! <laughs> uh, what I do in the world is my business, not yours. What, what did he even ask? What you do in the world may be your business, but here with me, you are my son. Oh my god. I can't begin to tell you how disappointed I am. That goes against everything I ever taught you. I want to talk more about this later. For now, let's just focus on our work. Oh no, he's mad at me. Right. The flooding shorted out some of the fuse boxes down. Look at his place, mouth! Including one that controls some of the automatic doors. Here, take these fuses. The box is back down in the sub-basement near the eastern... What? Why do you... God. So much busy work in this quest. Here, go do this. Here, go do that. Ugh. What do you mean, oh great? Were you talking to me? Are you saying the oh great Humphrey's here? Because that's not very nice. What's wrong with his face? He's this man's father. That's what's wrong with his face. Go on, son. Do my chores. I can't do a Liam Neeson voice to save my fucking life. I can't get in there. Dad, it's broken! We gotta go to the sub-basement. I like how Sharon is taller than James. Sharon is taller than everyone in the Capital Wasteland. He's, uh, he's probably taller than most super mutants. Okay. Where's the sub-basement? Where's the sub-basement? Where is the sub basement? Is this this isn't an entrance to the sub basement, is it? Everything all right? How do I get to the where do I go? I can't really say since I don't know where you are. Where am I now? In the security <laughs> you just said you did holding tanks for the war. You said you didn't know where I was, and then I asked you where I was and you knew where I was. The there we go. Place. You should be able to access the mainframe. No need to come back to the control room. Just head straight there. Okay. Alright. Do they actually reverse engineer how your parents look in this? Yeah, they do. I think that's how the baby works in Fallout 4. How, with how it kind of looks like both of the parents you create. But it's like backwards. I still haven't played Fallout 4. I don't really want to play Fallout 4 either. I just went around in a big circle. Humphrey's dad is kind of a dick. Hey. Let's not say things we can't take back. Um, I 
think this is the right way. No, because that's back to the future. This place is a goddamn maze. Mike, this quest is kind of long. Then maybe I should just call it here. How long have I been... What do you mean be cautious? We killed every... This place is safe as hell, Sharon. I should probably sleep, though. Maze. Ugh. Yeah, I've been streaming this for over two hours now, so I should really switch. But I, I don't want to... All right, I'm about to lose it. All right, here we go. What have you done? You're breaking the laws of physics. Actually, I don't know if I'm supposed to be in here. There. Perfect. Cello, thank you for the gift sub. There we go. Perfect. Just the way it was intended. Alright, how about we just save here? We're right next to the intercom. I'll remember to use it. Okay, let's let's stop. Let's stop and save and do a quick BRB. Thank you for watching Fallout 4 tonight. This was very fun. Um, I'm going to switch over to Super Mario World. We're going for all 96 exits. So we got a couple of them done. We're in the Forest of Illusion. There I, there's no danger, Sharon! Did I say Fallout 4? Wait, why are you saying follow? No, why is everyone saying follow four question mark? I didn't say follow four, did I? We're done with Fallout three. We're gonna switch to Super Mario in real life. Yeah, I'm gonna save again. Okay, I'll be right back. Uh, stick around if you want to watch that. If not, thanks for joining me. I will return shortly.